ABC News. Steph Tiller with the latest news headlines. Emergency services in Afghanistan expect the toll from a magnitude 6.1 quake in the nation's southeast to rise further, with 280 people already confirmed dead. The quake struck about 44 kilometres from the city of Host, 150 kilometres south of the capital, Kabul. Shaking was felt over a 500 kilometre radius by millions of people in Pakistan, Afghanistan and India. Australia's Minister for Defence Richard Miles has met with his Indian counterpart in New Delhi, where the ministers have reviewed their nation's defence cooperation. The meeting marks the latest engagement involving members of the Quad Security Dialogue that also includes the United States and Japan. The Quad is seen as a counterweight to China's rise in the Indo-Pacific region. And the Assistant Trade Minister Tim Ayres says the worst of the current energy crisis has passed. His comments follow today's announcement that from 4am tomorrow, AEMO will begin handing back control of the wholesale spot market to energy companies and 24 hours after that, the suspension will be formally lifted. The Energy Minister Chris Bowen says there are still challenges ahead, but Tim Ayres believes things are turning around. ABC News.